Welcome to Hydro Dip with Olivia. For supplies, you'll need gloves, disinfectant wipes, painter's tape, one or more shoes of choice, white primer paint, additional spray paint, any brand, but Craylon works best. Pick any color you'd like, use as many or only a few, that is up to you. Lastly, you'll need a large plastic bin and be aware you will get paint on this. Now we're going to prep our shoes. First, we're going to remove the laces because we do not want paint to get on this. Then I'm gonna take my painter's tape and tape up any part of the shoe that I do not want paint to have access to. This might be the most tedious part, making sure the tape is sealed around all edges covering the heel, brand label, and side design of the shoe. How you prep your sneaker is really up to you. You can get creative and make them different or you can make them the same. Something that might help you in this process is taking a bobby pin or anything that has a pointy edge or rounded hard edge that will help you seal those edges of the tape around any embroidery or heel. Okay, now that both shoes are ready, let's get ready to fill our bin with water. Make sure the level of water is deep enough so you can sink your entire shoe. And now we can prep our paint. This is a perfect time to grab your gloves. Now once you have decided on what color or colors you'll be using and which order you'll be using them, you can start layering them. For best results, hold the nozzle of spray paint canister close to water level. Spray in the center and repeat this with every color until the top layer of the water is completely covered. As you can see to the right of my screen, I have a little tool that I'm going to use to help me clear the excess paint from the surface of the water so that it doesn't catch on the shoe as I pull it back out. From here, I took a paintbrush and just created a little design before I decided to dip my sneaker. Make sure to hold the heel from the painter's tape, fully submerge, pull away excess paint and pull directly up. Repeat this with second sneaker and that is your final result. We decided to do a second shoe and this is a sandal that we will be priming with our white primer, letting air dry. And with this hydro dip, we'll only be using two colors, blue and pink. Fully submerge. Remove excess paint as best you can. When removing, pull straight up. We will set those aside and let them air dry. And that is your finished product for shoe number two. I had fun hydro dipping with you guys and I hope to see you for our next DIY. Thank you.